Yes guys, my name is Morsi and welcome back to my channel. EA have finally dropped some super saucy content during the team of the season. It is a naughty looking flashback card. It is an Argentinian man to go along with the Copa Libertadores promo, whatever that is that's going on at the moment. We got ourselves a 94 overall flashback, Carlos Tevez. Yes, now Carlitos Tevez flashback card with absolutely mental looking stats. The shooting all across the board, he looks like my ideal striker. And I remember using this man in the early FIFAs. We're talking FIFA 10, FIFA 11, FIFA 12 when he was in the Premier League tearing things up. He had a solid card. Probably one of my favourite players to play in the Premier League. Even though he's played for clubs at like Man United and Man City, I put the rivalry aside. I just love watching this man play football. To get this card done, it is an SBC. We need an 86 overall team with one team in the season and an 84 overall team as well so super cheap for a card with these kind of stats the main reason i think he might be so cheap is purely for the fact that he is in the libertadores league for boca juniors so there's not too many linkability factors but we have just got a brand new copa libertadores promo i wasn't on fifa yesterday so i missed the whole release but there's some insanely cool looking cards in there so linking him actually might be easier than expected but straight away looking at the man's stats the acceleration is there that's the one thing i remember using his previous flashback cards in previous years the pace the acceleration this man has is absolutely remarkable shooting stats nut mate with a balanced chem style okay we haven't put a chem style on it because you don't need to you get 99 attack positioning 99 well 98 finishing 99 shot power 95 long shots 95 volleys this card absolutely lethal i'm expecting him to score pretty much everything every chance he gets should hopefully be in the back of the net Passing stats are there. With the balanced chem style, you do get that little boost to 96 short pass for the linkability factor. The long pass, the curve, and the vision get a tiny little boost also. In regards to dribbling, the balance, the reactions, the agility, that is a big tick. 99 composure, 99 dribbling, and 99 ball control. This man should be super agile on the ball, super quick, close control, feet. That is what I'm hoping for. Stamina is a little bit on the low side. He's getting on now. The man's knees are giving way, but 85 should do a job. 99 strength and 96 aggression. This guy should be a pit bull. He's going to be so hard to tackle with the dribbling stats, with the pace, with the strength, with the aggression. Oh, I'm so excited, then. It's been a while since I've been excited to do a review on an SBC. Thank you for EA for hooking us up with this one. And we've got finesse shot tray, outside the foot shot tray, and fist bumps all around for the team player tray. So we're going to try out the finesse shots, try out the shooting, to basically test every attribute in this man's arsenal. I almost forgot to mention, guys, he is 5 foot 7, high low work rates, and 4 star, 4 stars. He's got the skill moves, he's got the weak foot. The attributes look mad, the card looks insane. I want to see a dynamic image. I'm hoping it is sick. But that is the card we're reviewing today, boys. Let's go meet the lads that he's going to be rocking with. Oh, baby, yes. Lanzini. Team of the season, honourable moments, is it? Honourable men? No, it's team of the season moments. Uh, objective card. This man's finesse shots, man. The long shots. Look at the stats. 99 long shots, 99 shot power. Him and Tevez, the Argentinian boys, are going to be tearing it up. The rest of the team, we got Vieira and Best in for chemistry. Insigne has come in. Hernandez, the back four, has stayed the same for the past 79 billion player views that I have done on this channel, guys. In regards to custom tactics, we got press after possession, lost five width and seven depth. The formations are 4 3 1 2. Tevez and Lanzini at top. Tevez is going to be the captain. He has got the armband and he is up top with Lanzini. Insigne is in the pocket. We got Awa, Patrick Vieira, and Best is our midfield three. Best will be subbed off at the start of the game probably for Lazaro uh, the back four stays exactly the same so that is how we're lining up guys I am going to do a more in-depth custom tactics video soon so stay tuned for that one but those are the custom tactics this is the team guys let's waste no time and get into some gameplay I'm not going to put a chem style on him we're going to leave him balanced because I feel like that maybe boosts pretty much all the stats I want to boost I'm not going to lie to you guys if there is a chem style that you guys would recommend, make sure to let me know down below in the comment section for the rest of the viewers to see. But I'm going to hop into some different one gameplay. I'm currently 2250 skill total. I don't know how. I seem to be winning matches, guys. I'm not losing at the moment. It's slightly concerning. Maybe it's the custom tactics carrying me through. But either way, I'm going to test all the attributes that Tevez has, see if he is worth the unlock. I'm going to put it all into a montage for you, and I'll catch up with you afterwards. I could be lying and tell you you're fine. I could be lying the rest of the night But I won't do it, no, no way I'm saying so I could pretend
pretend that you're doing okay. I could give in when you want it your way, but I won't do it. No, no way I'm saying so. He's been seeing someone else. He's been paying for hotels. Oh, it breaks my heart to have to tell you this. And baby. That felt good. That was a proper flashback session of FIFA for me, guys. Using Tevez again in his prime. This is a prime Carlos Tevez. The acceleration is incredible. The man got five goals, one assist in the two matches. And straight away, guys, you notice the power that this man holds, honestly. Acceleration off the, off the block. Absolutely rapid. He's so quick. The strength for the aggression. Players are literally bouncing off in like a pinball machine. When he gets in the box, he is lethal. I was trying some ambitious shots, maybe from angles that I shouldn't have tried. Uh, he pretty much he hit the target every time, essentially. He scored a decent few goals for me. Five goals, one assist in two matches in Div 1. is very, very nice. Uh, ball control, absolutely no issues at all, as you would expect, it's pretty much maxed out. Super agile, super close control, basically a little pivot, a little bay blade on the ball, lethal finishing, absolutely rapid. Passing stats were great, the link of play was fantastic. Physical stats, tick every box guys, the traits, they're my favourite traits in the game essentially. Like you cannot go wrong with this card. For the price, if you can get him into your team, if you've got icons, if you've got any of those Copper Libertadores cards, I'm not sure what the promo is called, by the way. I'm just kind of winging it here. Uh, and you can link him in nicely. Definitely get this card done. An 84 and an 86 team. Fodder, you've probably got a lot of it because EA aren't releasing that much content. Don't do the team of the season packs. They can go in the bin. Get this man in your team. I'm going to give him a solid 9.5 out of 10, guys. This guy is so close to getting the full 10. Um, I just feel like to be a 10 out of 10, you've got to be the creme de la creme. You know, you've got to be the best of the best. This man is very, very, very good at 9.5 out of 10. We don't throw them around lightly, you know. There is a few areas that he probably could improve in, for example, the skill moves. If he was 5 star, 5 star, definitely getting a 10. The passing stats could be a bit better and his stamina could be increased a little bit. So those are the reasons he's not getting the 10, but 9.5 out of 10, guys, get him in your team.
And anyway, guys, I've been Morsi. I hope you enjoyed this one. If you're new around here, please do consider dropping me a subscription. Leave me a like, drop me a comment, let me know what you think of Carlos Tevez and this player review. I have a new series coming soon to my channel, so stay tuned for that one. I'm not going to disclose any information yet. I'm just going to drop it on you guys out of nowhere, so get ready for it. And the Euros is soon. Fingers crossed we get some sort of content based around that. That'd be fantastic. I'll catch you very soon for another video, guys. Take it easy.